My journey to learning that I was BRCA2 positive has had a tremendous effect on my family specifically. It's had an effect on my sister, who because of her early detection of BRCA2 has allowed her to be able to treat breast cancer early. She often says, or she'll tell me, you saved my life, or you you are the reason why I'm still alive. And it's it's really hard to accept because in my mind, like the testing was so small, but it really puts in perspective how big it really was because that one step led her to get genetic testing, which led her to detecting cancer early, which ultimately did save her life. My BRCA testing results definitely spurred on my sister to be retested for the specific variant that showed up in my results. And my brother is going to get tested as well. He has children. And my parents feel that it is their responsibility to be tested as well. I was able to uncover these risk factors for the rest of my family. And all of these amazing, strong women in my family took measures into their own hands to prevent another diagnosis in my family. I have a sister and I have three female cousins. We were all between the ages of 25 and 30 when this happened. And out of the five of us, four of us have BRCA1. And I'm extremely proud to share that all four of us had bilateral mastectomies already. My mom and sister both decided to get tested after I shared my diagnosis. It's scary knowing that not only is my sister uh, positive for this, but I'm at risk as well. So while it was scary, they also took the measures that they needed, the steps that they needed to. My story has made a positive impact on my family's life. They're calling me at all times, talking about genetics with their friends and different opportunities to take it to the next level, to continue to educate, educate, educate.